hey it's the empire don't forget to hit the like button the subscribe button and the bell icon for more videos be taking over let's go champ hit that like button hit that subscribe button right now let's go hey it's the empire geoboxing empire back to boxing now man porter weighs in on this whole danny garcia adrian granados fight and he weighs in by actually comparing the both the fighters now between adrian granados and danny garcia Porter actually says that Adrian Granados was the harder fight. And that's shocking to a lot of people because Danny Garcia has been champion for a long, long time. And, you know, he just recently lost the title, you know. But that being said, Danny Garcia is highly rated way over Adrian Granados. Uh, Adrian Granados has actually never been a champion. He's just a tough fighter. Now, <clears throat> I'm going to get some quotes exactly what Adrian Por uh, Porter said. Now, he says, and I quote, if I have to put a name on it, Tougher fight, the tougher fight might be Adrian Granados, said Porter, who defeated Granados by unanimous decision. I, I give it to Adrian based on his pressure and his relentlessness throughout the fight. So that, those are the words from Sean Porter, man. And, you know, that fight was a, a hard fight for uh, Porter, man. I mean, Porter was getting, he was he lost a couple rounds. And I think he hurt his hand or something like that in the fight. It was, it was his hand or his arm. Something happened. But, yeah, man, he, he was, you know, Adrian Granados was really tough in that fight. And he came forward. And Granado, the thing about Sean Porter is, uh, in an Adrian Granados fight, you know, it, Sean Porter is known to be an aggressive fighter. He's actually known to be so aggressive that his shots get smothered. He smothers his own shots because he's so close to you. He's so aggressive. He's too close to you. So he's throwing shots. He's, like, hitting around you. It's really weird stuff. But Granados was actually good enough to actually work in a pocket with Sean Porter. And Adrian Granados fighting Danny Garcia. Danny Garcia is like a hook master. You know, his best shot's left hook. But his right hook is pretty decent too. And I think if Adrian Granados can handle the volume and, and the amount of punches that Sean Porter was throwing, that he can handle uh, Danny Garcia's left hook and, and his other, you know, shots. Because Danny Garcia, I still view him as a small welterweight. And Adrian Granados is pretty big, man. He's, he's always been bigger than all of his opponents I see in the ring. And it's crazy because Granados is actually a smart fighter moving up. But, you know... So is Danny Garcia. But, I mean, I've I seen Granados. He just looks bigger than any other fighter I've seen at 147. He even looked bigger than Sean Porter when he fought him. And for Sean Porter, he used to be a former middleweight. So, that being said, this fight's going to be a really good fight. It's happening really soon. It's happening on Saturday, April 20th. And this, this is going to be a really big fight, man. Now, I didn't make a prediction for this video yet. But it's basically looking like Sean Porter is leaning more toward Adrian Granados because he gave a politically correct uh you know, answer to the question by saying his experience and who was a harder fight. And it, it sounds like Adrian Granados was a, was a harder fight. So I'm guessing he's leaning toward Adrian Granados. Now, it's crazy because um, and this is by BoxingScene.com. There's like a, you know, some quotes from Danny Garcia and um, Adrian Granados. And they go into how, um, I guess, Granados called Danny Garcia his opponent. And... You know, usually that doesn't happen if you're a champion. Usually it's the it's vice versa. So if I'm a champion, I say, you're my opponent. You know, it's, it's the other way around. And Danny Garcia is not used to being a contender anymore. He's used to being a champion. So he's like, hey, man, don't call me an opponent. You're my opponent. You know, I'm the champ. I'm still a champ. Even, even with these L's, I'm still a champ. So Danny Garcia still has the utmost confidence in himself. And, you know, you know, uh, Danny Garcia only really lost to the best. You know, he lost to... Uh, Sean Porter, who's basically most of his losses to, at the time at least, current world champions. You know, uh, he lost to Sean, he lost to Keith Thurman, he lost to Carol Brook, and uh, ever since then he's been he's been in the role. So that being said, you know Sean Porter has been looking really good lately in in his fights, and so I mean Danny Garcia losing to Sean Porter or Keith Thurman isn't isn't that big of a deal because both of them are current champions right now. So that being said. Um, uh, this is gonna be a really good fight, man. It was cool to see Sean Porter weigh on this uh fight, and basically, like I said, he's leading more toward Adrian Granados. We're gonna see how they perform, man. It hasn't been much hype for this fight, but it's gonna be a big one, man. And I'm really excited to see his fight. You know, Danny Garcia. Uh, I see him in an interview as well. He was talking about how he's gonna fight maybe a couple more times this year. He said he could probably squeeze one more time this year. Uh, Danny Garcia is notorious for fighting once or twice a year. He said, he said <clears throat> he, he can try to get three fights in. We'll see how everything goes. But, you know, I'm not looking past Granados. I'm just saying activity alone, he's just going to be more active, you know. Um, the thing is, 
Danny Garcia, you know, him and uh, Manny Pacquiao could easily be a thing. I mean, Danny Garcia is still an upper echelon fighter. And we're going to see how everything plays out. Granados is a phenomenal fighter, too, based on Chicago. Rough and tough over there. If you haven't been there, hit the like button. Tell me how it is. But tell me part of Chicago you're from, man. But Granados is a great fighter, man. We're going to see how everything unfolds this Saturday, man. Let me know how you guys feel about uh, Power Porter's comments, though. Leaning more toward Granados. Like, comment, subscribe. This is the Empire. Geobasic Empire. Peace.